Victims and families of the deadly Santa Fe High School shooting are finally getting their day in court. The civil trial starts tomorrow against the parents of 23 year old shooting suspect Demetrius Pogorchis. Good evening and thank you for joining us this evening. I'm Bill Barajas. Victims, loved ones and witnesses of the 10 people killed in the Santa Fe High School shooting gathered tonight ahead of the trial. KPRC 2's Corley Peel spoke with one parent about her plans to take the stand. It's been a long six years and the family, survivors and witnesses of the deadly Santa Fe High School shooting believe the accused gunman's parents should have done a better job at monitoring his mental health and restricting his access to guns. The night before the civil trial, loved ones privately gather outside Santa Fe High School, spreading hope. We've been waiting a long time for more answers and the day's finally here and we're all happy. Rosiana Stone says her son, Chris Stone, died while using his body as a barricade to prevent the shooter from hurting his classmates. I think the 10 deserve justice and I think that my son deserves justice. He was a hero that day and I want to continue the fight that he started. Stone's son was one of the eight students and two teachers who were shot and killed in May 2018. 23 year old Demetrius Pagochis was 17 at the time when investigators say he opened fire inside Santa Fe High. The civil trial is against his parents. We are suing the parents because of their um, irresponsible gun ownership. Um, I truly believe that if they would have had more ownership of their weapons, we probably wouldn't be in the situation that we're in. Do you plan to testify? Yes, I will be um, taking the stand. I will testify. Do you know what you want to say to them? I've waited six years. I know exactly what I want to say to them. And um, I can't wait. Pagochis was charged with capital murder after the deadly shooting. He has not faced a criminal trial after he was ruled incompetent and placed in the state hospital. I never gave up hope. Um, still, like I don't give up hope that we, we, we may one day see the killer go to trial. Um, I live off on hope. I don't ever want to lose hope. And the only thing that I want people to take from this is every fault that you find, fix it. Every loophole that you see, fix it. Every good that you see, praise it. Don't try to just brush everything underneath the rug how it's been doing. This civil trial is expected to take three weeks and jury selection starts on Monday morning. We will be closely following this trial on air and on click2houston.com. In Santa Fe, Corley Peel, KPRC 2 News.